this is still being debated, this shutdown was years in the making. Governor Cuomo, the chief proponent for the shutdown, claiming he feared that there could be a major accident potentially affecting millions of people. So tomorrow night, an operator will push a red button in the control room and turn off power for the last time. When Indian Point's two reactors went online in the mid-70s, it generated about a quarter of the electricity used in New York City and Upper Westchester. Saddled by a number of safety and operational problems over the years, proponents of the plant's closure feared a major nuclear accident or a terror strike. It was impossible to evacuate. There's no plan that could get 20 million people out of the 50-mile danger zone around this plant. The environmental group Riverkeeper has been a chief advocate for the plant's closure, often citing problems within the plant itself, particularly a situation back in 2017. There were seven major mishaps. You know, the bolts holding together the walls of the reactor were found to have failed at a rate higher than any other reactors in the world. Indian Point is the largest employer and taxpayer in the small village of Buchanan. Its mayor told me she and many residents have never feared the plant. I think those fears have been exaggerated by people who are anti-nuclear. The nonprofit American Nuclear Society agrees. But there's new science coming in every day that shows us that radiation is really less worrisome than we thought it was in the past. The plant's number two reactor was shut down a year ago. Friday's shutdown of reactor number three will pave the way for a more than $2 billion decommissioning process expected to take 12 years. Contrary to the critics, Entergy, the company running Indian Point, asserts that the plant has run reliably and safely, virtually without interruption. With the lights out at Indian Point, New York, at least until other sources of efficient energy are utilized, will get its energy from fossil fuel burning natural gas plants. The risks of closing Indian Point to the public health of New York are greater than its continued, oper its continued safe operation. Closing this place three times over through energy efficiency, renewable energy, battery storage, we're ahead of the curve. With closure just hours away, the mayor of Buchanan has something to say to the workers at Indian Point. The village of Buchanan thanks the employees for their dedication and safe operation of Indian Point. Now, many of the 750 employees there now, they'll be offered other positions at company facilities, and the state will help locate the others. Meantime, the state says it will work on that site 10 years from now, and redevelop it commercially and residentially. I'm Marvin Scott, PIX11 News.